It's your Feel Good Breakfast Show Expresso on S3. Now our next guests are local musicians, Ricardo van der Horst, Dustin Julius and Sumeri van Skolkwijk, who together make up the band The Rise Up. Now take a look at some of their music. Ask, how does it feel while you sit on this couch to watch yourself and hear yourself on, on screen? It's not actually one of our favorite parts. <laughs> really? <laughs> no, we love making music. Okay, you just it, don't want to hear yourself. No, you have to hear yourself. And looking at yourself <laughs> is a different, like an oh my word, why did I dress like that? Why did I do like that? But oh, you know, <laughs> that's all part of that yes. journey. But you know what? It's always so beautiful to see music bringing people together. And you are all three musicians in your own right. Tell me the story. How did you get together and decide we are going to be called Rise Up? Oh, wow, we, um, Ricky and I met in 2019. We did a show together. And then forward two years later, I phoned him and said, I need a drummer for another show um, last year. And then the beginning of the year, we were sitting without a band. We were sitting without work. Um, much. Yeah, and then we said, listen, you know, why don't the two of us just get together and make up a band? Mm -hmm. And then he and... Um, Dustin know each other like forever. 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 Yeah. So and then he brought us Dustin into the. That it's, is, a, it's a fellow musician who actually brought us together. So. Yeah. Well, isn't that just amazing? I mean, you know, you you guys have always been, you know, playing the instruments, being part of the the different shows that's mm. there. And why did you decide on the name Rise Up? Because I love how you guys took that opportunity to create your own work, especially during a time when industry tends to forget about the musicians yes. during COVID. That's exactly why we, why we chose that name. Yeah. Um, all of us musicians and um, most other people as well went through a, a difficult stage through, through the pandemic. We lost a lot of people, musicians, family members and loved ones. And then after we lost our job at the beginning of the year, I said, you know, we can't sit down. You can't say, no, no, that's it. I'm going to quit music. Mm. You rise up, you stand up and say, listen here, we're going to do this again and yeah. build something from scratch and make it happen again from scratch. That's yeah. why we said rise up. Rise up. That's yeah. amazing. Now, Ricardo, I'm going to ask you, what is, um, what's been the highlight so far, being able to work with Dustin and Sumiri? Well, I think, I think it's also like um, three different worlds coming together as one and also like creating something nice for people, you know, um, people like to hear some good music, but also like um, a beautiful voice as well. <laughs> so I think uh, with myself and Dustin, we're trying our best to make it, to enhance the music, but also um, also being the backing band for such a beautiful vocalist like um, Sumeri. So I think that that's something really nice and we always just like to strive um, and to enhance the music. Okay. And make it nice for, for our audiences and so. Yeah. Dustin, where did your love for music come from? Um, it started at church. Yeah. And after that, um, moved into the secular and yeah, then it happened. Then it happened. Yeah, it just happened, yeah, naturally. <laughs> and look how this just happened naturally. It was meant yeah. to be. Now, I know that you guys have a tribute show coming up and it is a tribute show to the four best female singers of all time. Okay, let me guess. Celine Dion. Yes, of course. Whitney Houston. <laughs> yep. Yes. Yeah. Mariah Carey? I can't do Mariah Carey. No, okay, not <laughs> Mariah. She is like above my vibe. My, my, my. <laughs> okay, who are the other two? Um, Roxette. Roxette. Yep. And then Tina Turner. Tina Turner. Mm. That's going to be quite exciting. So it's taking place on the 6th of May. Yes. You guys will be doing this tribute show to honour these four iconics. And I want to know from you, where can people get more details? How can we support you on the 6th of May? Um, you can email us at riseup.capetown at gmail.com for tickets and info. And it's going to be on the Belleville Falle Church Hall. Okay. Yes, there's a lot of space. 
You know, it's going to be awesome. You can bring your own snacks, your own, your own cool drink or drinks you want to do and just enjoy the evening with us. Oh, fantastic. Are you guys going to be giving us a sneak peek of what to expect at the show on the yes. 6th of May? Yes, we're definitely going to do that. Okay. <laughs> well, we are looking forward to your performance. Give me that email address once again. It's riseup.capetown at gmail.com. Email the band. They are here this morning. They're going to be performing for you on your Feel Good Breakfast show, so don't go anywhere.